Hi. Um, this is, uh, if you like, a follow-on um, to the Qi Ball video. Um, it's talking about um, the work with um, energy and the work with your body. Um, I've just been doing, uh, you know, some intensive time with the work of Byron Katie, and I've been very impressed with it. Uh, uh, basically, that, you know, this the way that she has of really investigating the thought, and I think that's really what my Taoist teacher in China, uh, Professor Lu, taught me was to investigate the qi. Now, the qi is the connection between the thought and um, the body so this this area in between between there's the, there's the mind there's the body and this area in between is called the chi now if there's a problem in the mind then there's going to be a problem in the body and there's going to be a problem in the chi if there's a problem in the chi yeah it might not be reflected yet in the body but you probably will see it in the mind um, this is where you know the field theories of you know if you're in a negative energy field that can you know affect your mind and can affect your body. This is where all these theories come in. Um, so um, when you when you're holding your chi ball, yeah, what I'm interested in, in you doing is using your mind to uh, go into that ball. Yeah, say so I've got. Let's see if I can do this. So I've got a chi ball here and I, I, I'm holding the ball and then I use my mind to go inside and feel is it fluffy, is it light, is it heavy, is it turning, is it moving, is it turning anti-clockwise, clockwise. If I close my eyes, what, what uh, colours come into my mind? Um, that's a way of getting, getting to know the chi. Now, in just the same way that uh, Byron Katie says, if you want to be freed of a stressful thought or a thought which causes you suffering, meet it with absolute love, yeah, unconditional love. And it's the same way with Qi. Um, and this is what Tai Chi Touch does, yeah, is you meet your um, painful energy. And this is very often, you know, the psychosomatic sicknesses are, are literally just painful parts of you know, painful energies, uh, you meet them with unconditional love. And that means investigating them and just trying to understand the way they are, not judging them and saying, this is bad, and that, you know. Um, and you, we, when you do this with Tai Chi Tai Chi, the, the energy, um, if, you, if you really can open your heart, yeah, and you're not trying to defend yourself, the energy really, really opens up and uh, causes a spontaneous healing. Now this, uh, the point is, if you're doing it for somebody else, you, you're only ever really doing it for yourself because it's only ever your mind that's perceiving somebody else. So it's a way to heal yourself when you're treating somebody else. So you could argue that Tai Chi Touch is just uh, self-healing. Okay, well, um, I love give, making really short videos because I always run out of things to, uh, you know, to say um, when I'm just talking to myself. And um, I've given you a different background today. I'm in the kitchen. Okay. Well, if you've got any comments uh, apart from the fact that I'm boring, which I already know, and the fact that I put people to sleep, which I already know, thank you for that comment. I can really totally relate to that. Um, you might actually um, have a comment to the content and how you could relate to it or not. That would be useful for me. Okay, so I wish you all a wonderful day and uh, till the next time. Bye.